Along Oro Dam Boulevard, unobstructed views of Oroville Dam's primary spillway, a reconstructed spillway with water flowing down it for the first time. Lisa Garcia and her husband relocated here from Fairbanks, Alaska in the summer of 2017 to work on the spillway. There were a lot of long hours and a lot of hard work, but you know, it's he, you take a look at it now and it was all worth it and sure it was worth it for the people that are here too. Monica George is one of those people. It's really good to see it back in working order. Monica lives a half mile from the Feather River, one of nearly 200,000 people who evacuated two years ago. It was scary. It was really scary. So, and I've lived up here 25 years, 30 years, and so it's really good to see it back in working order. Colvin May, an Oroville native, performed some of that work last year. I think the quality of work that went into it was above and beyond. Colvin comes to appreciate his efforts, and so do dozens of others. Cell phones held at eye level, ready to record this historic moment. We wanted to see what it was doing, what it looked like. You know, it's pretty awesome. These flows, just the start of what's to come as the Sierra snowpack begins to melt.